back for round four? Round three or four? R round four. We, we've done what you've seen. We've done everything. We made our circuit after you've seen the first recording. And then we get our minds going. And we, we start building up new ideas. And we got more insane as usual. Now, we're going to do the same overhead extended locked out arm squats down to the seat. We're going to toss sandbags in our hands, which is now officially unilateral. It's going to be bilaterals with the, both hands holding one unit. Now unilateral hands, still bilateral feet because we're still based on the floor here. But listen, this is going to shake things up because the body wants to move and wants to stabilize and the weight shifts. Jason is better in this functionally than I am. So don't get it twisted. Just because I'm a little strong, I'm a little guy, I still have trouble with this. Watch. The only movement that I'm better at him at. One. The only, only one. Movements. So, <laughs> jot one down for Jason. All we right. like to always try to get our stuff the hardcore way, so we're going to clean these up. Clean each one. Look at this, folks. Look at this, folks. Oh. All right. Now the real struggle begins because you got to get it just right in your hands. See? That's the first time he's dropped the butt. Look how he recovers. Cleans it back up. Uh, as I was saying, this is the hard part because the sand wants to shift. Shift in all directions. So you have to get your hands right, get a good position so it stays in your hand. Battery's low. Uh, and so we can do it. Uh-oh. Come on. Yeah. Beautiful. Looks good so far. But watch this. Looks great so far. Come on. Keep that one tight. Come on. Come on. Squeeze, squeeze the sandbag, Terrell. Squeeze the sandbag. My hand in my left hand. Okay. Just carry it. Right hand, I can squeeze. Come on. Come on. Keep it tight. Double lock. Double locks. Come on. Uh, every effort counts. <laughs> left arm wants to leave the body. You got it. Ah, uh, keep it extended. I'll give you one more, but you notice I'm not keeping a good extension. One more. Uh, 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 uh. Folks, it's a constant load. Never does that thing stand still or stay together. Shoulders are doing all kinds of stuff. Wrists, forearms, down to my fingers. I feel it all around the core, especially the spine because of how deep we're going with the overhead extension. Do not do this unless you are practice in your squats. We'll see you with something else insane soon.